Hey football back with another video and you know me and I'm sure to you know what time it is Jamaica versus Costa Rica last night and it is now confirmed no mathematician in the world can can save Jamaica at the moment is it yeah we are we are we are actually out we have absolutely no chance no mathematical no dreams nothing of going to the World Cup in Qatar at the end of the year. And 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 to be honest, it 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 ja like yesterday dog like may I be honest with you. Know? And if you don't watch the match you know, can see especially in the first half Jamaica dominate Costa Rica. Literally dominate. Push them back create whole heap of chances them just never score. It's like it just never for we. Them, them goal charmed or something. We don't know how Jamaica can score last night, dog. It, 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 impossible. Is it Wally per chances create? Back line was excellent. Was very excellent. Uh, minimal amount of chances Costa Rica created. Just that one uh, brilliant effort from Joel Campbell. You know, a, a good quality player. We see him in the World Cup, I think, in 2014. So you know him, him I'm a quality player. Probably not at the same quality he was then, but, you know? But, like, Jamaica get chance after chance, save after save from Navas. Missed opportunities after missed opportunities from Jamaica. Like, me, me I watch the match and me I say, yo, Jaja, if, 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 and then Costa Rica get the penalty, me I say, yo, I wonder if I feel them, I just Jamaica, bad luck. Andre Blake with, with two penalty saves in two games. Who is this guy? Is he from like them did just for score? Just take two of them chances and, and, and we're still in with a chance. But I guess it was not to be. Father got have something else planned. But all in all, I'm not gonna lie. One of the best games I ever sit down and watch for Jamaica. In terms of build up play, ball moving through the midfield. Me actually see every player go to Ravel Morris yesterday. Every player between him and Devon Williams, the ball play through the midfield. You see Jamaica midfield, you see the attacking line going forward. We try to play some one two. some of them never come off. But you see, we see the little, the build up play and them thing that will be in the arcs for me. I wonder if Paul Hall, me, I wonder maybe he can do something with that, that crap up um, players here. But to be honest, it was very, to watch, watching the game, although we never take the chances, watching the game, watching Jamaica. It was very pleasing to see the type of football that was being played. The result was not favourable, but to be honest, man, we, we, we play some good football. You see, we play some good football, and the only thing we can complain about is that we never score. Antonio never taking chances. I think Giovanni's got a chance when he come on off a header. He see, it and a lot of other half chances and stuff. Andre Gray, this close to touching the ball. You see, it and, and another player, Andre Gray really look like, you know, Look, probably if Nicholas probably would have put in one of them, yeah, even you know, one of the team, but that's a conversation for another day. You see, but a, a player that really impressed me, you know, Ravel Morris, he never played so good in the last game, so I have to shout him out. This game, he really stepped up, he was seen on the pitch, him and Devin Williams in the midfield again, I have to say. Absolutely beautiful. Um, Left back, Kemar Lawrence, left back position, look, in check. I just won game, so I'm not going to say nothing, but. After that performance from Gregory Lee, you really have to look at him. You look at him. Really and truly have to look at him. Going down the wind, attacking, and then getting back to defend. And 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 him with the solid in show himself in a tackles, one a couple falls up the pitch. Dog, ah, that youth yeah. Him, him, him look good. I'm not sure him how much. You see, I look it up last night, but I remember right now. But to be honest, him look good. You see, him look like a, a competition for that left back spot. So Taxi you not know, so comfortable. You know, one man got between the sticks and dog, uh, you know, two games, two penalty saves, and we just never take our chances. Never take our chances. So, I guess that's it for now for Jamaica. You know, the, the World Cup qualifiers, we have no chance of going to the World Cup. But, positive to take, it was a good effort. It was a very good effort. If we see fight and we see the actual ball, I put on, we see the actual ball, I go forward. We see build up players through the midfield. Yeah, one and two long ball, but most of the time them actually try to go through the midfield and build up slowly then. You know? That one see crosses going into the box. 
it was honestly a good performance from Jamaica. If we did take with chances, boy, Costa Rica could have beat you at the office. But I say, God, football is a very dreadful sport, unforgiving. You don't take years and a team take theirs. That's what's going to happen. So, make we see what's in store for Jamaica for the future. This group of players with a couple like Atari, McGee, and others can come in. The you to give the penalty, Kevin Stewart. As I'm saying, the last game him come on and play good, but that was a silly foul about Andre bailing out. But Joel Campbell had other ideas, so you know, so that's it for Jamaica. Hopefully, we can see more of this going forward because if we play like this throughout a qualifying process, I'm gonna see why we can't go to all a 2026 World Cup. You see, but that's it for now, guys. Continue to like share comment and subscribe follow us on our social media platforms the link will be in the description below